Hello everybody, I am Brandman19 and welcome to episode 60 of our United States of Earth capital. campaign, Supreme Lord 2020. Bulgaria just fell. Uh, they kind of relocated their capital. I kind of expect them to fall sometime before, but hey, that's a little bit more money to us. Uh, about one billion more to us, actually. Speaking of money, we've kind of wasted about a billion there um, on research. We can get some stuff done, though. Got a new tank, the TF-1 Thunderfrog. Let's go ahead and put it in. New nano construction, so facilities build speeds up by 2%. That's some good stuff. And let's keep these guys going. I'm going to go ahead and fight Greece, too. Might as well. Uh, we'll leave these guys up here. They can repair and... Uh, well, they're going to have to repair there. Thought that would be done by now. Guess not. Let's go here. Let's keep sending our units on. I mean, I'm going to keep putting the pressure on uh, Greece here. Alright, maybe we can come on back here. Grab Halkida. Halkida. And then we should probably be in great shape. Uh, yeah, with Bulgaria gone. We're, I mean, looks like we're also working on uh, the Ukraine harder right now. Not a bad idea, honestly. Be nice to go ahead and grab Saki here. If I get some units away from this fight, we can do it. Going after Halkita because it's that one spot before pushing in and going after the stuff around Athens. Come on, keep pushing, guys. You guys got this. There you go. Actually, let's keep going. I want you guys to go here, knock out Athens' uh, military fabrication facilities. No clue where you're attacking and where and all that, but hey. We'll send these guys here to Elvis. Maybe we can get some shots going. Uh, you two. Yeah, you're alright. There we go. We're knocking out Calandrian right now. After that would be Athenae. And uh, Elvis. Come on down here and give him a hand. Try to take out this town first. That way we can get away a little bit cleaner. Almost got it, actually. A couple of garrisons and stuff like that, but overall not bad. Those guys go. Um, I don't like grabbing when I just grab, but okay, we can deal with it. Come on down here. I guess as they pop out, I'll grab them. How much is there in reserves? Uh, not much, actually. Not enough to really push a really good offensive or anything, but. I'd have to try. We need reinforcements. There we go, knock out these guys. This will fall pretty quickly and easily. Yeah, that area should fall for sure. Here. There you go, you're in this region, you're good. Come on right here. Looks like they're going after Athens already. Let me see here. Um, let's look at kills. I've killed 20,000, almost 21,000 units. Only losing 27, 21. That's like a... Uh, 
you know, 10 to 1 kill death ratio. That's pretty awesome. Russia's lost 12, 4, 23. They've actually gone up to 8.92 million casualties. We've gained 55 million in land. We have, yeah, twice the, the amount that China has, like three times as much as Russia has. We just need to keep going. We're doing a really good job. Alright, we'll hold out here. Uh, these guys are fighting it out pretty hard through here, though. Like seeing that. Let's go ahead and repair. Is that fixed? Yeah, that's fixed up. We did take that facility, these facilities over here, that's good. Okay, looking good. We fought in the Viet, yeah, here we go, in the Vietsvisk. Which is one of those places that I wanted. We want to get Mahalio too, because it's on that river. Go ahead and try to take some of this. Getting ready to work our way to Saki before long. We need reinforcements. We're down to 67. They're down to 5%. I could probably just keep pushing in and they'd fall out. Elections coming up and we're at 44%. We get 43.7% of the... Uh, of everything right now. <laughs> I think we have enough people to fight against too that we don't have to worry about uh, declaring war either for a little while either so we'll take what we got come on down here I want you to come on over here I want to take Athens guys over here. There we go. We're doing pretty good, though. For what we have on that front, we're doing better than I expected. We need reinforcements. Uh, let's send these guys here. I don't want to circle too much. Not on this front, I don't. down here. Oh, there they go pushing off. Oh, we're prepared though. Let's go here. Send that guy here. These guys are getting knocked out pretty quickly. Send these guys here. here. Well, there's just one land fabrication. That's not much of anything. Uh, let's come on down here to Saki and take trying to get secure all of this down here. I mean, we did, we already have this pretty much guaranteed. But it'd be nice to have a little bit more land production down here. Go. Pushing in, push down here, push this guy to here. Go Sebastopol is ours, the Black Sea Fleet headquarters. We need reinforcements. Go take this. Got that. Come on over here now. Sit this guy here just in case he makes it there. 
pushing our men all the way over here. Same with this guy. There we go, we got both of those. Ran right through the peninsula too. Going after Kirch. I really wish I could build that bridge they've got building right across here. Ever since the Russians took over the peninsula, they started building, they built that bridge. There it goes. Wonderful. We took their capital. We've taken whose capital? Oh, we took Athens. Oh, wonderful job. Must have been really using that uh, artillery there. Oh, we got quite a few units in the area. We need reinforcements. Let's bring you up to here. We took their capital. Up oh, there goes all of Greece. I'm going to take out that one. I'm going to take oh, all those are fun for now. Anything out here? Nope, not really. Anybody down here? Go ahead and repair. You're going here. This area down here is fine. Get into there. I'm going after the Ukraine. I'm going to close up a front here. Not to mention when we take all this, if Moldova, if you know Moldova doesn't take that area too, and we go to war with Romania, we'll have another way in up this way. A quicker way to a front on this edge, that is. All right, um, I want you to try a push, and I want you to be ready to assist. Ukraine's money is slimming down. So is ours, but we're doing a pretty good job. We're at 53%, by the way. Articulated vehicles. We need reinforcements. That's a thing. So is... Oh, that's what we just got. Uh, we're at war with Romania now. See, exactly. Just who I thought we were going to do. There's only two ways in the country, but that's okay. Not really all too worried about them pushing south, but we'll find out. Matter of fact, I might give them the little push they might need. Two, three, four. We're gonna go. Let's go here. Their capital's here. But the idea being we'll take over Bucharest and we'll get that awesome uh, land those land facilities. If we continue to knock out two or three, uh, you know, uh, two or three countries at a time, we're gonna be in great shape. I mean, we are already in the 60th episode. I mean, this is two months. This has been going on. So, I mean, we are already that far. Let's go ahead and try to push in here. Looks like we're gonna. I think we'll get in there. Ready? They're pushing down here. We're gonna push right into their capital we region. Reinforcements. That should give them enough of a scare. There you go. Let's get that supply up and running into here. There you go, run into here. Perfect. We actually are about to take their military facility as well as their capital come on we got a whole Gorgiu unless we can take their capital then I don't really care yep there goes that I got some interesting units down there let's go north we took their capital 
We did take their capital. Or somebody's capital. Whose capital? We took oh no, we got we got St. Petersburg. Okay. I'm happier to take that. Take the area around it. They're gonna move their capital either here or out here somewhere. Take that. Take this. We took their capital. And we just took now here we go. We took this one's capital now. Run through here, there you go. We need reinforcements. They moved their capital to Minsk, I would think. Yep, that's exactly where it went. We're just going to grab this whole area out here. Secure the area. Should push all the way over here to Helsinki, but I know I'll be at war with Finland for doing that. You know, like, at war within, like, no time for doing that. Move forces in that direction. I don't mind chasing Russia all over the map, to be honest. It's just building up some time for me. There you all go. Um, let's send these guys here. Let's go here and knock out this land fabrication facility. Yeah, uh, Ukraine, you don't really have a chance left, man. You got really good artillery that you've gotten from the Russians, but that's about it. This area has pretty much fallen into my grasp. Send these guys here, send those guys there. We'll bring these guys over here. Smartly expanding out. We need reinforcements. Trying to make a way over here to Cryova. They got quite a bit of money too, so it might be smart to. We'll take Braia, cross there, take this town and come down here. Let's go ahead and take this. Let's have these guys move up here. Let's send these guys across to there. Let's come on down here. Caracal, we're out of there already. One, two, three, four, five. There we go, move these guys in. You're coming to there. There you go, let's push in over here. We'll be on the board, well, more on the border with Serbia. Going after Galati. There. There. Let's go here. Um, come over here. Let's go take this port. We took their capital. The capital's fallen. Let's go here. Should be in good shape to grab it. They got their Black Sea Fleet. Which we're fighting right now. Uh, they moved their capital up here to... Uh, we took their capital. Well, their capital's gone. We actually won it. Not bad. Alright, guys. Uh, take a break, actually, if you want. 
Well, actually, pretty soon this is going to start pushing down on us, so we couldn't really take a big break or anything. Uh, go ahead here, I guess. Let's go ahead and start giving it a chance. Uh, these guys here... They're getting really... Getting pretty close. To Minsk, that is. Let's go here. Oh, this XAV can come all the way here, I guess. If I want that guy to run to there. I want this guy to kind of... Focus here. Any artillery in the way I want knocked out. Nope, don't do anything. You don't have the forces to do it. Uh, you might could try, but I don't think it'll be good enough. Looks like, yep, there's a little push these guys might need. We're knocking out Kiev right now. We took their capital. Whose capital? Oh, Russia's capital, okay. There goes all of Russia. <laughs> Alright, we now share borders with China. Tajikistan, which grabbed all of that. Um, Uzbekistan, of course. They pretty much just gave a, they gave Finland and Norway all of this. They gave me all of this. Ukraine, some of that. Germany, some of that. Germany actually has kind of like their old empire back. Pretty cool. We need reinforcements. Gave some to Hungary. Who is this? Mongolia got like a sliver all the way up through the middle. They're in the middle of China. They gave... This looks like South Korea. Yeah, they gave South Korea all of this. Not bad. Okay. Well, no more Russia. Thank the Lord for that. Been fighting the Russians for forever. We actually border Germany now, so... Getting done here quickly is going to be very important. We need to kind of get anybody who's attacking us on the western border done. Oh man. How many satellites do I have ready to launch? I saw another one was finished. I have eight ready to go, but we got twelve we more before it becomes anywhere near accurate. Send these guys here. Send those guys there. Probably Germany. Uh, it's actually Hungary. Okay. Not super duper worried about that. They border us here. We have units down here. Not a big deal. Nope, all of you are going to repair, though. That's going to put us more on the border with Germany. Direct border with Bosnia and Italy. Which we don't want to do. We, we don't want to be on the border with those guys. There goes Serbia. More direct borders. Just took over Kiev. Come on, give me all this. They probably won't because Brest and all that's in there. We need reinforcements. They moved it all the way out here to Lublin. That's the capital of Ukraine now. Lublin. All the way over there. Okay. I see how it is. We're sitting at uh, 66% by the way. Approval. For Trump. <laughs> let's go here uh, let's go on here let's send these guys on here we'll try to push into the back here take over 
Brest and the rest of these guys. There is who? Macedonia, okay. We are really going to war here now. There's Chernobyl there. I always thought they should like make it where your units, if you're they're sitting in Chernobyl, you can't have any garrisons there. And then if you're sitting there, that your units should be like slowly going through damage. Unless they're like NBC equipped, you know, nuclear, biological, and chemical equipped guys. Let's go ahead and push on down here. Who's our next, who's the next best guy? Uh, China's at 30, South Korea at 20, Germany's at 25, Italy's at 20, 13. The first person I'm at war with is, you know, directly is Uzbekistan at 6. Yeah, these guys just don't have a chance. Now I'm going to overrun them. With Russia now gone, makes my job much easier. Okay, looks good. Um, just gonna kind of play around with you for now. Let's go down here. They had to turn off the land fabrication and the aircraft fabrication. They don't have the units to hold it. We're going after leveling though. That's done. I do wish I had this open too. We took their capital. There goes Albania. Looks like all the Balkans want to go to war with me. We're just running over these guys here. We did take Lublin. They moved their capital back to Kiev. I don't know how they quickly got that back, but it's okay. Oh, that guy did. He probably snuck around from somewhere. Sneaky, sneaky. Let's grab this guy, come up here. I'd love for Moldavia to go to war with me. Be perfect. Uh, these guys... Doing fairly well. Lviv is out here. I'm bringing more men up here now. In fact, I might go ahead and try to take Lviv too. We took their capital. There goes the capital again. They're probably going to move it down here. They still have means and ways to uh, move with. here. Uh, now they moved it here. The Nitz, yeah. Yep, there it goes. This guy's gonna fight on that front. That's fine. We're gonna try to break in. Take over that area. Maybe connect up through here. There goes Germany. Which means a corridor through here is very important now. And across there, actually. Let's get down here. Let these guys kind of play around and get what they need. Yeah, we're going west. West is the way for us to go right now. It's like the only, you know, direction for us to go. These guys there. Uh, let's use these guys. Good lord, the Albanians are pushing and we're not doing a darn thing about it. Get down in here and start fighting. Yeah, 
You start sending men north. Come on. Let's do this. I'm trying to get corridors. That's all I'm trying to do. Knock out Ukraine and take out corridors on the way. Send this guy down here. We that looks like capital. a good possible way. There goes their capital. Come on, Ukraine, give up. Nope, they put it there. We took their capital. Nope. Alright, now they gave up. Alright. Sweet. Okay. Well, guys, I think I'm gonna end it right there. We did take over quite a bit. Uh Finnish Russia, Ukraine. Uh, I think we did Bulgaria and Romania and Greece. We took out a lot this episode, I feel like. But uh still a lot more to go because now we're under we're attacking almost all of Western Europe at the time. Which is uh Really a bummer. I didn't really want to be going to war with everybody at once like this, but uh, I guess that's what I'll have to do. So, all right, guys, appreciate y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check out Discord, and I will see you guys next time.